Hello viewers, today I am going to show you how to replace the battery of JBL Flip first generation. Before starting the process, please subscribe to AudioVis 360 and hit the notification bell icon. Now let's start the video. So I have this JBL Flip first generation. Battery backup of this speaker is very low. It is coming just 10 minutes. So I am going to use this battery to replace the old battery inside. So let's start disassembling the speaker. This is the battery, the backup is very less, it's working fine but after fully charged it gives only 5 to 10 minutes and it takes long time to charge actually. So I am going to replace this battery with this new batteries, so size is almost similar, it will fit in the speaker. So there are two batteries here of 3.7 volt. It is connected in series here with this BMS. So this total output of the battery is 7.4 volts. In that same concept, I am using this 3.7 volt, two batteries, two batteries of 3.7 volt. Now I am connecting these two batteries in series and putting back in this BMS. So we have to remove this BMS from this battery. There are two batteries here which is of 3.7 volt each which and it is connected in series with this BMS so the output of this BMS will be 7.4 volts. So you can see in this BMS I am showing you one of the negative terminal of the battery will come here B minus and plus will go in the BM1 and the other batteries positive will come here B plus and the negative terminal will go to BM2. So here we will get 7.4 volt of output. To do that we have to work on this battery little bit because the terminals are different. This total metal has voltage here negative positive terminal and this is negative the small one. So if we put like this short circuit will happen so to prevent that I am going to use this piece of hard cardboard I will keep here in between these two batteries so it will not touch and I will wrap it up I will insulate this battery so that it will not change its position. Now let's insulate this using this abro tape. Uh, one more thing I want to say this is of 2000 mAh battery that is each is 1000 and this is also around 1000 mAh, maybe around 900 or 950 mAh. So I have these 4 nickel plates, I am going to spot weld on this battery, so let's do that.
all right the battery pack is ready let's insulate further now everything is connected if you test the voltage here in this terminal plus and minus you will not get any voltage it will be zero you have to boost boost this battery through external charger or else you can directly assemble it in the speaker uh, once uh, the charger connects to the speaker it will start working now i have boosted this battery just to show you the voltage it is coming here plus with plus and minus goes to minus you can see 7.4 volt 49 volt is already there that is the least voltage now after charging it will become around 8.4 volts so let's put this battery inside the speaker and we will charge it then i will show you the demo also let us insulate it further now let's put this in the speaker yeah after connecting the terminal speaker is getting turned on all right All right, speaker is ready. Let's try for charging. Red color light is coming. Let me charge it for 15 minutes. Then I will show you the demo. Yeah, charging is done for 15-20 minutes. I think this is enough for demo. Now let me connect the speaker and directly show you the sound. Thanks for watching the video. If you like the video, please do like, share, subscribe to AudioVis360 and write comment in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Bye.